why did I join Deloitte? Um, perhaps my route is not the typical route. Um, me and a couple of friends, two friends, we had a bookkeeping business and uh, in the process of trying to find support for our bookkeeping business, we came across a guy called Jeff Androin, who was a partner at Deloitte at the time. And uh, he started helping us with our bookkeeping business. And in no time we had met another partner, Osman Abi, who at a stage, you know, in that same year, then convinced us to start our articles. Where it was even before we had finished our degree. Those days it was possible. You know, I am perhaps revealing my age a bit, but anyway. <laughs> so, yeah, so we joined. Um, that was uh, back in 1994 number of things that have made me stay you know um, the first thing is that Deloitte has so many career opportunities you know I've been in audit I have been in fist audit I have been in corporate finance now I've been involved with public sector so although I have been in the firm for 17 years it feels like I've done different jobs over the time you know so that's the first thing the second thing that's made me stay are people you know each time I thought about leaving, there was always someone who had looked after me, who made me stay, you know, and in time, I had also convinced people to stay, you know, so I felt an obligation for those, towards those people that I had convinced that this is a great place, you know, so I couldn't tell people that this is a great place and then I ran away, you know. What makes Deloitte stand out? Yeah. I think it's culture, you know, we have a very unique culture, we have uh, a go and get it culture, we are a team, um, so that's possibly the biggest thing that stands out. We as, as a firm have always led transformation um, and we continue to lead transformation. But transformation is not unfortunately one of those things that um, is a destination, it is a journey, so you must keep trying to reinvent yourself and making sure that you stay relevant. So we've definitely um, led transformation and are successful with our transformation initiatives. We now, as a, as a firm, going towards our third black CEO, while most of our competitors are only on their first black CEO. So, you know, we've, over the years, have been leading transformation. It's difficult to prescribe um, what contributes to success, but the only thing that you can do is, is to be true to yourself. You know, there are obviously some core fundamentals like hard work, making sure that you are very good at what you do, making sure that you are good at developing people because that's also part of, of, of what contributes to any individual success. So it's difficult to prescribe for an individual, but you know, in one sentence I would say it's about being true to yourself. Personality traits, I, you need to be definitely a team a team player in this in this environment. Uh, you need to be someone who is hungry to do their best at every opportunity. You know, so you you yourself must have exerting standards that you want to live up to. You know, we have a vision that says we want to be the standard of excellence as the firm. You know, we would not be a standard of excellence if each individual did not live to 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 that value of wanting to 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 reach the standard of excellence in everything they do.